Before starting this video, do not forget to hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon to never miss any update from this channel. What's up guys, Mr. Android here and welcome to episode 8 of Best Android Setup. Well, I already featured this setup in What's On My Android video and you guys absolutely loved it. So in today's video, I will show you how you can get this extremely good looking home screen setup on your Android device. So with that being said, hit that thumbs up button and let's get started. As always, links to all the required elements will be listed down in the description. Make sure you download them. And once you are done with it, just apply the wallpaper and set no launcher as your default launcher. After that, just remove everything from your home screen and make it clean. Then head over to Nova setting, go to desktop, set the grid size to 8 by 5. Disable the page indicator and also enable widget overlap and overlap when placing. After that, go to app and widget drawer, set the grid size as 6x5. Enable the card background and set the background color as black. Next go to dock and disable it. After that, go to look and feel and set the icon theme as project X. Finally go to gesture and input and make sure you have set swipe of gesture for app drawer. Well that's pretty much it from the Nova setting. And I will also provide you the backup file in the description so that you can easily apply the entire layout of this setup. Alright once you are done with the Nova settings just arrange the icons in the home screen. As you guys know that I am using project text icon pack and it looks extremely good with this wallpaper. So the time and date widget that I am using in this setup is from Alloy for Zooper. For that what you have to do is just tap and hold and set the widget accordingly. Then just add one more page to the home screen. On the second page, you can add all your frequently used applications. And I will be using a small widget from Hug for Zooper. So just tap and hold and set this widget called Applications. Finally, I will also be using a small weather widget from Today Weather app. So that's it guys and we have completed our setup. If you guys like this setup then make sure to give this video a thumbs up and also do subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. I'm Mr. Android and I will catch you in the next one.